What do you think it is? Beer. What if it's like a monster energy drink? Possible. Oh, boy. <laughs> so as you guys can see, this isn't just a cool um, beer label. This is a mystery beer, courtesy of Joe from the Beer Patrol. He sent um, us a box of beer with two mystery beers and some other half beers. He also sent Kyle a box as well with mystery beers and some other and some other half beers, that the same beers, and we just recorded two um, collaboration videos. So one's going to be on our his channel, one's going to be on our channel, so check those out. And uh, if you haven't already checked out Joe's channel, um, definitely check out the Beer Patrol because um, it's an amazing channel. He definitely knows his shit. Definitely more than, than I do. I don't want to speak for Mike. but No, more than me too. I'm, uh, he met both of us. I said to Mike in the joke, I was like, imagine this is like a cool lager because we're talking about like refreshing beers. And I'm like, well, <laughs> don't sniff it yet. Damn it. Let's make sure we're even in case this beer is delicious. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all the ones we've done so far you've poured way more than me yeah i know i have no i, I don't think i have by on purpose i'm just not we're not i'm not used to doing tikus like i, I really enjoy our uh there is something on this this smells like caramel almost that's a nice that's a nice head that's what she said it's gonna look wow nice. this is a this beer is wafting yeah <laughs> It this, a, it's dark. It's black. Dark. Yeah, I don't see any red here. I don't see any brown. This is this is pretty much black. I get a little bit of like almost orangey brown. Let me see if I can get a head going on here. Oh, no. oh man, this is gonna have some. This is gonna be a high BV beer. Look at this. I'm not even getting any. Ah, there we go. I got something. But like, that's me. I got plenty. I know, but that's some alcohol legs. Ah, uh, it's just made very quickly. Maybe not. Maybe um. Ah, no. There it is. Okay. This is this. this seems like it has something on it. All right, we're getting the nose. Yeah. Almost like salted caramel. Yeah. That salted caramel for sure. <laughs> the only salted caramel salt I can think that reminds me immediately is the break side. That was a super letdown. Yes. And that did not smell like this. No. I remember that being like, oh, this is salted caramel? No, it's not. This is. I'm getting like a salted caramel and a faintest, faintest amount of like almost like a espresso. I was actually going to say, yeah, espresso. I was like, uh, I wonder if Joe watches our videos enough to know Mike does not like coffee. <laughs> yeah, it's just salted caramel and like a coffee's like way far in the back. Yeah, it's almost like espresso that that bitter kind of dark. Yeah. It's it it smells like one of like um like a Starbucks drink that like Carrie would get. Yeah, like a caramel macchiato. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Anything else you're getting on there? Uh, the, 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 the caramel like is very rose. strong. I don't smell any barrel. I'm always getting like that toffee-ish thing. Yeah, like definitely caramel, toffee. You know? Toffee like butterscotchy maybe. Yeah, butterscotch is a good way to put it. Yeah. yeah. Oh, it's good taste. Cheers. Cheers. Huh? Uh, it's a coffee beer. You know, a lot of coffee in the flavor. I think so. Yeah. I got like a Yeah, you're right. But I get a little bit of alcohol too at the far at the far back. Like it hits at the, the at the very end, like yeah. almost almost where you would expect a, a beer to bitter off. Yeah. It hits a, a, a bit of booze. Yep. Um but I'm still getting that like the caramel sweetness is still there. But it's the it's a flip of the nose. Yeah, I agree. The coffee's there, and then the caramel is the salted caramel is is like just sitting at the back a little bit. Mm -hmm. But it comes in for me personally. I'm digging it because mm. <laughs> um, because it just kind of like you get that that bitterness of the coffee. The sweetness is still there, and it says in the back of your your tongue, and then you get a little bit of alcohol. Um, it reminds me of like biting into a also some chocolate so that you get yeah. like uh that kind of gives but the chocolate is giving me a eating a um, chocolate covered espresso pea i was gonna say something like that actually have you had one before yeah it's very very horrible <laughs> i like them um that's what i'm getting from this but but the caramel actually stays on the aftertaste the most for me a little bit you know the coffee is still there, mm -hmm. and I'm, I'm sure it's probably more prominent for you, given your dislike. 
Mm-hmm. But um, the caramel, the sweetness is just is just sitting there, and it, it's very nice. This is this this is a very nice beer. What are you what are you thinking for? Um, I'm sorry. What are you thinking for ABV? From the alcohol eggs, the nose. Well, for me, mainly from the alcohol eggs and the taste. I don't know. I'm gonna go ten. Yeah, I'll hit like around 10, 10 4. Yeah. Um, you getting anything else other than the coffee? I mean, it more or less follows the nose. Yeah. I'm getting, I'm getting a little bit of the ashiness, which you usually get from a stout. Uh, mouthfeel wise, though, it's kind of not creamy. It's almost, it's like medi- light, medium syrupy. Yeah. Um, so yeah, I'm going to say, do oh, you think this is a quarter? No. Hmm. Well, as soon as you tell me the difference between a porter and a stout, then we can have that conversation. Well, I'm thinking like thinner mouthfeel. I think it's a stout. I think it's about 10%. Mm-hmm. I think we're getting, I, I, I think it, uh, coffee is a major component of the, uh, coffee or espresso. Yep. Um, we don't know how much more we're supposed to. Yeah, caramel, it's, vanilla, possibly. Yeah. Um, I couldn't tell you what 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 this beer is though. I've never this this isn't ringing any bells. No, me neither. Yeah, so I think we're both on the same page. It's a imperial stout, about ten percent with coffee for sure, or well, coffee or espresso, whatever, what have you, however you want to say it. Um, and then caramel. Let's see how we did. I hope it's a, I hope it's a dry hopped pilsner. Me too. <laughs> I totally didn't wrap his this good. This is my well. I I wrap his like in a good way, but like I think I don't know how they wrap them as well. Just take it from the middle. Oh, I got it. I got it. Oh, I guess yeah. Yeah, that's probably a smarter idea. Huh? Ooh, what's this? This is Omnipolo. Okay. Um, Pro Dromos. 10.5%. Cool. Flavored extra strong beer. Graham cracker. Chocolate chunk. Caramel bar stout. Ingredients. Water, barley, wheat, oats, hops, coffee, vanilla, cocoa, natural graham crackers, natural graham cracker flavors, and caramel. I think we did pretty good. Yeah. Do you get the graham, graham cracker? Um... It's easy to find things after they tell you what's in it. No, I still don't really get it. I guess not. Uh, no, but this is a this is this is. But we we did pretty good. Yeah, I would love to get more of this beer just to have have Reed try this too, because given his love of coffee beers too, he would shit on this. Uh, I don't think I've ever had an Omnipolo Stout, which is pretty awesome. Yeah. Um, am I gonna be drinking the rest of that? I'll drink it. <laughs> um, yeah, so I think we, I I I think we did pretty good. Um, let us know in the comments if you think we did if we actually did terrible. Um, sorry, Mike. For what? I don't know that you don't like coffee beers. The the whole point of this is not what you do or don't like; it's what you can pick out and guess. That's valid. That's valid. Um, yeah, the game is still the game. Yeah, that's a good point. Um, but yeah, thank you again to Joe at the Beer Patrol for sending this mystery beer. Um, I can't wait to dive into the second one. Um, this this was fun. This is this is this is delicious. Um, the graham crackers. Maybe maybe as it warms up, um, I I should have put them in a different fridge, but I didn't. Um, it's fine. It, it there's still a lot of good flavor. Like 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 the chocolate was there. We got everything, but 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 the graham cracker. And I even said vanilla at one point. Like so. Yeah. No. Um, I, I I actually was thinking at one point I was more like candy bar ish, you know, to some degree because. Yeah. Um. But I mean, you you either say it or you don't say it, you know. Yeah. And it was canned. Uh, May eleventh, so, and for and for a cell like this, that's perfectly fine. It's still yeah, drinking yeah. like super great. Um, but yeah, again, thanks to Joe, and um, let us know in the comments how you think we did, um, and if you've had this beer and what you think of it, um, and if you actually get the Grim Cracker or if you're still with us and you just get the chocolate and 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 the, and the caramel. And uh, please like, comment, and subscribe. Please, please, please like, like and subscribe. And on Nerd Sense on it, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. If that's your what. 
please, please, please. <laughs> please, please. What's, 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 what's that song? Like, please, please, please let me get what I want. It's like a Smith's cover. Sure. No, no, no. Weezer covered it. It's a Smith song, I think. Let me know in the comments too if how, how wrong I am. And uh, Nerd Sense, <laughs> like I said, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. And uh, I'm Sean. I'm Mike. And, and this, this is, is Nerd Sense. Sense. Everything.